former army psychiatrist who killed 13 people at Fort Hood has again sparked anger after a report was released detailing a montage of outlandish requests he made before standing trial. The special treatment that Nidal Hassam received in the run-up to his trial is valued at millions of dollars incurred by the US government, including around $200,000 spent on daily helicopter rides to ferry him from jail to Fort Hood. Hassan also made requests such as clocks, Bibles and even cheese created by a particular manufacturer in his sandwiches. This is the latest outrage sparked by the murderer following the 2009 brutal attack after the US government worked to classify the attack as workplace violence as opposed to calling the Al-Qaeda-inspired killings an act of terrorism. By not labelling it as a terrorist act, all soldiers who were killed in the event have been denied Purple Hearts simply because they are identified as victims of a tragedy as opposed to combat. Hassan was convicted with a death penalty by lethal injection, a sentence that has not been given to any active duty US soldier since 1961.